submitted my application for studying abroad. We finish everything today. So I have my first thermodynamics tutorial right now. It's going to give me major flashbacks to last semester. But I really want to attend every tutorial and every exercise to fully prepare myself and then hopefully pass the course. So I'm now on my way to find a new locker because I have one where I put all my books in but this one is actually in the main library and this semester I wanted to study more at this other library so I'm going to get a locker there. <laughs> so it is the next day right now today i just had a very slow start to the day because i just felt tired today i didn't have university I just have my japanese class again there weren't any classes for the past two weeks because there were actually school holidays and then we don't have any classes but i'm just excited for the lesson right now and i'm glad to focus on studying japanese again and i think i didn't talk about this yet but i actually decided to book another japanese class i first thought that maybe i was going to take the a 1.2 course which is like not the beginner beginners level then not enough people register for that so i just took another course that is at the beginners level and i think that's also okay because it focuses a lot more on grammar anyway before the class starts i think i'm going to study a bit at a cafe I'm just going to revise the vocabulary that we learned
I realized like yesterday that the deadline for my application for studying abroad is very soon so I definitely need to log in today and work on that. I mean I'm like almost finished but I still have to finish three different documents and also write texts and decide exactly which courses I'm going to take studying abroad. So at uni today I have one lecture and then after that I'm going to study at the library and hopefully finish everything that I want and then tomorrow is my last day and I'm going to read through everything and make sure everything's okay probably also give it to some people so they can read through it but yeah today is just about finishing my application completely We just went to the cafeteria and now we're at the library. We actually booked like a study room, so I hope that the room is pretty and then I can get very focused. I will now stop working on my application for studying abroad and hopefully I can finish everything today. We have the room until 6 pm. As you can probably tell, I'm very, very stressed right now. I literally woke up at 5 a.m. today because I had to finish my application for studying abroad. I worked on it for hours and hours yesterday and at 1 a.m. I just couldn't think anymore. Like I knew that it would be very stupid to continue because my brain just couldn't function anymore. And I basically calculated like how much time I needed today to finish it before going to university. The thing is I have like a mandatory class today. Like of all days, I have it today and it's like a laboratory with my group so i knew i had to get to university by 10 a.m and i also had to prepare some things for the laboratory so i just woke up at five 
continued working this morning until now and now i'm very glad that i was able to finish everything i have now submitted my application for studying abroad digitally so in the system but i also have to submit it like as paper so that's what i need to do today i have two classes and then after these classes i'm going to submit it <laughs> Also irgendwie so entweder so Ende Dezember oder halt dann äh, Januar. Ich weiß halt nicht. Lass noch einen holen. <lacht> So I just submitted my application and I don't really know what to feel. Like for some reason I don't feel that relieved. I mean of course I'm glad that I don't have to work on it anymore but I'm kind of scared of the day that I get my results. Anyway I'm still very proud of myself for doing this. I actually just can't believe that I did this like right now that I actually have the chance to study abroad it's still crazy Thank <laughs> you. 